The City of London has an open data portal. So this is a website that's accessible basically to anyone with an internet connection for free. And these are data sets that are basically open to the public. All different kinds of data. So pretty much anything you can think of, they have information about you know how many different roads, the traffic volumes that are going on the roads, parks, they have information about all the parks in the city. It gives the stats for you know number of trees or number of parking lots or you know anything and everything. They wanted to improve their portal, so they want us to find out what are the best practices. How user friendly is the open data portal? Are there any missing data sets that uh, the users of the open data portal would like to see uh, on the open data portal? We have made tried to make a survey to get all these uh, answers. The whole purpose of the uh, survey is to gather information, analyze the information and uh, draw conclusions on uh, what is the portal data being used for, how often is the data being accessed, what improvements we could make to the uh, data and the format that's on the uh, portal. This has been a fantastic experience working with City Studio. So it's been an opportunity for my students to get practical hands-on experience with research. And I think that's going to be really useful for them in the end, uh, you know, after they have completed this program. Yes, they will have been taught, uh, you know, all of the specific things that they need to do to run a good research project, but then they also will have had the hands-on experience through the City Studio project. One of the the best things about the program for me so far has been the fact that we get to work with so many of these real, real world companies and see how uh, what we're learning in school can actually apply in real life. Somewhere down the line I can see myself talking to someone and saying that uh, you know uh, the city of London data portal we had a hand in the development of that in some way which is probably a very good feeling. <laughs> From the students' perspective, I think they were able to really learn all the specific processes and factors that have to be considered when you're fully carrying out a research project. And this is a real research project. So it actually goes with my goals, uh, this project. Like if impacting people, uh, that's something I want to do uh, in future. You know, any project I want to maybe start up something which helps people, which helps the community. and. As I am going to stay here in London um, for the next year, some uh, big, big part of my life, that's why it, I think it's a good opportunity to get along with the community and do something right now because that's my goals for the future too. Uh, knowing that we're actually making an impact in our community is a, is a pretty cool thing.